dirt bikes, Baltimore, an association that is all too familiar for the family of 24-year-old Allison Blanding, mother of a young daughter killed by a dirt bike back in May. I think about my... I think about my god sister every day. Saturday, in light of the recent clashes with the city over dirt bikes, the family wanted to send a message to police as the case still remains unsolved. Change needs to happen now. It's not just a dirt bike. It's not just guns. It's not just knives. Change needs to happen now. Bland's family said it happened right here in this parking lot when the rider of a dirt bike popped a wheelie and came down on Blanding's head. Police say the rider of the bike took off before they could get to him. Dirt bikes are illegal in the city, but it's tough to enforce. Police can't pursue these bikes safely as they move through the streets, so they urge people to help do something when they're stopped. So when you see someone moving a dirt bike, storing a dirt bike, we want you to contact police. An effort that Kimberly Legree, a community clergy in northwest Baltimore, says is a step in the right direction. Know that people are working on your behalf, and these people aren't in front of cameras all the time. These people are not in political positions. Especially in the face of doubt from members of the community. Don't just sit at home and complain. Find out where you belong. Find out where you can help and go do that. Omar Jimenez, WBAL-TV 11.